everyone, the Red Spirit here, aka Cyber Joe 20. Um, I'm on episode 14 of Cowboy Bebop. Let's get into this. This one, I saw a preview, and I don't know, it looks interesting. Chess? Something about chess? Anyways, let's play. In 3, 2, 1, play. But you didn't pick up any leads or clues? Come on! <laughs> <sighs> There's a movement out there to sue the company for damages. Then the guys who cut him don't get a penny! Sorry, you guys! So, listen guys, why don't we all pony up the information we have on this case and agree to split the bounty three ways? Right. You're the one who said to work separately. Can't believe it. After all, we each wanted the bounty to put in our own pockets, right? The unit immediately sent the cash credits over a secured link to a bank on Europa, at least in any way. All the culprits were caught in the act. None of them have anything in common. What the hell? Good programmer? Right, yeah. But the guys from the Gate Corporation suddenly became very uncooperative. They didn't want to talk about it, you know. <laughs> hey. <laughs> yeah. These pieces are it. They're still our best clues. Give it to Ed. <sighs> I'm afraid there's no smoking allowed in here. Actually, I don't have planned out in advance. You gate guys know exactly what I'm talking about. You put a bounty out on some mastermind who may not even exist, which means you don't want the police to know who's really behind this. Right. Our guest is leaving now. Make sure he's escorted out of the building. Shit. Come on. We should have never taken such a risk. If this thing ever gets out, you know what will happen. Chess Master Hex. It is a game for him. Chess Master Hex, huh? <laughs> Looks like, um, Jim Pachi. <laughs> Ed? Edward is very busy right now. Check checkmate! <gasps> Ooh. So Ed thought. I like this fellow. Chess Master Hex, 98 years old. <laughs> been dubbed a genius from his teens, he held the champion seat for decades, joining the program at 30 years of age. He eventually developed the central control system that all gates use to this day. He said the design had defects and the gates shouldn't be built yet. He wanted to run more tests. So they fired him and built the gates anyway. Revenge after all these years or what? Some help now. Give me that still. Ed, we're trying to find a guy named Hex. He's in cyberspace. Edward is playing chess against him right now. Huh? It's strange, though. I tracked him through Edward's game and we're coming up on him. Maybe it's a false trail. I mean, look where we're heading. Would he be in a dump? People moved in and started living there. No government, no nationality, no taxes. Remember. <laughs> There's a lot of cats in this show. Peace to the whole galaxy. Wow! <laughs> well, could you be just a little quieter, please? Old man. Hand it over! Pain! 
That's quite a large pipe there. This my first formidable opponent in ages. He must be some player to pin you down. A few minutes ago, blast it. Really? Did I like it? I love that it's so Who are these shot. guys? Don't know. It's all a mistake! <laughs> the old duffer's out of touch. He can't recall yesterday, let alone 50 years ago. Lucky for him. Hex is no longer here. There's no one left but an old man who loves to play games. He set up the sting to kick in 50 years later when the gate was pre-scheduled for its first automatic tech upgrade. Like pieces scheduled to let you know that he had finally gotten back at you. Hex got old, completely forgot about the traps that he himself had set. Your dirty little secret will remain a secret. He can't tell anyone about the defects you built into the gates. What do you want? Money? Is that it? Just leave the old guy alone. Call off the bounty hunters. That's all we ask. Ed would be unhappy if she lost her favorite chess partner. They're nice. Are you playing again? Not again. Ed's still playing. You played the same game for a week? Uh, yo, newbie, you're in a good mood today. Check me. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs>